I'd like to welcome you all to the Joscar Awards 2010. Um, when Robert came up with the idea and said, Brian, I really want to do these awards. I want you to run it. I thought, great, that's me not winning an award. Um, but we came up with a jury to decide the shortlist from the, short, from the nominations to come up with the shortlist of awards. Um, that jury consisted of people from Australia, South Africa, Japan, Canada, the USA, and England. We had trainers, authors, extension developers, template developers, and site builders. Um, so we had a, a, tried as best as possible we could have a wider range of people to decide the shortlist that you've all voted on whilst you've been here. Um, we're going to try, Johan and I, to keep this event flowing, try and keep it a little bit quick. Um, I did have the idea of doing it like the Eurovision Song Contest. We did have one problem, however. There's 27 countries. If we ask for voting from all 27 countries, it's going to be like the Eurovision Song Contest. It's going to go on till tomorrow. <laughs> so I don't know about you, but I'm quite happy to stand here and talk all night. Me but too. I don't think you're that happy to listen to me all night. I can already see Fotis there on the front row, <laughs> desperately trying to stay awake. So I do have my webcam pointing at the two of you, Fotis Michelle. So if you fall asleep, it's recorded. So, the way it's going to go is um, we're going to announce the uh, category and the shortlist, and then Johan's going to get one of you guys to come up and open the envelope and present the award. So if you don't want to come up, then don't try to hide, because I will pick you especially. OK, so the first category was community website. And the nominees are? Altogether uh, as a whole, dot org. <laughs> I, I could. <laughs> I could. I could do that, but I leave that to your own imagination. <laughs> Community.getto.org. This one is easy. Joomlacommunity.eu. And rideschannel.com. And then. And then we need somebody to present that. And for this award, I'm going to go with the gentleman all in the back on the left in the red. Yes, you. You were trying to hide, but it's not going to work. You come up here. Oh. We better give, it, give it a second. Stand, stand in between us so we know where you are and not going to run and hide. You are. My name is Christian You're from Austria, Salzburg. We I have had a, a small talk here. Great. <laughs> and you have the honor of presenting and, and giving the award to who this is going to be. You can open up the envelope. Can we have a drum roll, Brian? And the uh, community award, right. website community award, goes to, goes to all together as a whole. Dot org. <laughs> and, and who is this? Please, then please. And to collect the award, I'd like to invite Nicholas to come up and collect it on behalf of the All Together as a Whole site. Nicholas, where are you? Show yourself. <laughs> Applause, please. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. Uh, thank you for this award. Uh, thank you for being such a wonderful community. And, uh, it's yours. Yeah. <laughs> I'm, I'm so much into talking, I almost forgot to pick up the award. <laughs> and a huge thank you to the 800 and plus members, uh, all the Joomla developers who have contributed to making this website a huge success. Thank you. Oh, Nicholas. 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 We're, we're still getting used to this, so. Yeah. We're still trying to get into the flow, um, but it's going to go better with the last one, I, I promise. OK, so the next category is for the best non-profit website. And the nominees are afrowho.int, coolplanet2009.org. Where do I get the difficult ones? <laughs> FSD.ch. And womensrefugeecommission.org.
this gentleman has been smiling uh, for the last week, uh, for the last two days, right? Wait, uh, he, even with shop. beer and without beer, he smiles and he still keeps smiling. This is why I get him up front. <laughs> nice smile, by Great. the way. Great. Great. Uh, what uh, toothbrush uh, and uh, toothpaste you use for that? Uh, well, just yes, yes, some stuff I stole from my wife before I came here. Uh, excellent choice. Mm -hmm. <laughs> she doesn't know. Go ahead. And All right, let's go for it. Website nonprofit. I did both. Let me get you this, and then you can do it like this. All right, the winner is afro.who.int. <laughs> And who do we have for that? You should push it as well. For that? Brian, is that? Where is he? So, very big congratulations. Here you have your trophy and the other trophy. Can you say a few words? Yeah, yeah. Just, I'm gonna say your name as well. Say your name as well. Um, my name is Matthew from Cape Town. I think everybody knows that the World Cup's in a couple of days. Um, I just would like to say it's been amazing being here. Um, I, it's been good to meet all of you um, who contribute to the Joomla in, uh, code and stuff, and uh, especially meeting the developers. I don't think we've met everybody yet. Um, but it's been a fantastic opportunity to do that. And I wish, hopefully, in the future that we'll do this in Cape Town. And if you guys can spend the money to come down to us, and then we'll host you guys. Okay. I don't, I don't know. You're welcome. Martin? I didn't know. I haven't seen you. Brian. Okay, so the next category. This is, one is tricky. It's for the corporate website. And the nominees are, and I'm saving this because Johan's got the fun ones to read out again. <laughs> Not again. <laughs> <laughs> you can swap if you want. No, no, I'll go. Gazetta.gr Freaktout.de Tooboxcreations.com and Vortman.net And uh, I'll pick one. I want the lovely lady over here. Come on. Thank you. And the winner is. The winner is. The winner is. Wait. Nobody wins. Gazeta Dr. Ah! Photos, you can first take take the award, take the award, take the award, take the award. Get the kiss from the girl. It doesn't happen a lot on stage, so you can show it. It doesn't happen a lot on stage. <laughs> oh, <one. laughs> and now you may say a few words. Wish. Thanks, Iron Man. Uh, <clears throat> this is a team effort, obviously. Uh, it's, uh, it's an honor for us to take this award. Uh, Chris was basically the guy behind Gazeta.gr. Uh, Lefteris as well, with K2. Uh, yours truly, and uh, Chiara has, uh, has also helped, along with Katya. So uh, I guess you have to say one word and... Yeah. <laughs> Joomla did good work here, eh? <laughs> it worked. Thank you, guys. And the next category, the blog website. And the nominees are... Oh yeah, that's why I start first. <laughs> Who should that be? Brian.teeman.net Joomlablogger.net SoutLaSalle.com And altogether as a whole, .org. And I want one of our Brazilian friends to come and give the award. One of our Brazilian, a big applause for our Brazilian friends. They came all the way from Brazil over here. 12 hours flight. Come over here. Right. This is like where you um, open up the envelope. <coughs> okay. And then you say. And the winner is Brian, Brian Thiemann. Thiemann. The original intention of these awards, and I made a mistake on the form, was to, to reward not the people that write the content on the sites, 
because the Gazetta journalist didn't win, but the people who created Gazetta.gr won. So for this one, I want to give the award to the person that actually built the website, Chris Marinou of Joomla Works. Come on, Chris. Wait, one yeah. other word. Yeah. Wait, 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 Chris, Chris, wait, you got another one. Yeah, thank you. One, two. <laughs> I wish Brian was more careful with the images he, he selects for his content. No, I'm just joking. Did good, did good. Keep the good work. Thank you. Okay, so moving along. The next one is the best Joomla free template. Is that free as in free beer, Brian? Was it free as in freedom? Or was it again? Libra. Libra. That's, that's clear, right? And the nominees are... Bees. JA Purity 2 from Joomla Arts. And Quasar from Rocket Team. And I am going to find one of our Hungarian friends. Tibor, come here. This is Tibor, by the way. Come over here. Don't be shy. You're always so shy. This is organizer of the, uh, of the Juma Day in Hungary. Tibor. Thank you. Welcome. And the winner is Bees. Angie. Where is Angie? And Robert. Two people. Come over here. Angie and Robert. Angie. Where is Angie? Angie. Ah, there she is. You get the certificate and one award, and you get the other one. And you can say something. Oh, I can say something. <laughs> yes. Yeah, um, thank you for this award. Uh, this was a lot of work. Um, actually, uh, Joomla was um, one, five, but it was beta. They changed everything every week. Yeah. So it was a lot of work. Who was doing Do that, actually? I'd move away. I'd I, 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 don't, I don't know. Ah, I'd move away. You're going to lose the other leg. <laughs> One thing to say. I can promise the next piece version, I never use the color purple. <laughs> <laughs> One, quick, One quick question. When is, when is the next version of Beast becoming available? To, to uh, point the zero we have? Yeah. I think the most of the people already know what will happen with the Beast template. Yeah, and um, we have this 2.0 and this uh, version with the HTML5 uh, called Beast 5.0. Great. Thanks. <laughs> the next category is the best commercial Joomla template. This category received the most nominations online, and I'm reliably informed by the people who counted the votes that it was a close call, there was a recount. Uh-oh. And the nominees are... Avante from Joomla Bamboo. Creativa from Prothema Joomla Junkie. J.S. Sulfur from Joomla Art. And Mello from Uthing. And I need one of our Dutch friends. One of our Dutch friends, I look at you because you're Dutch and you're standing in front of me, so come over. This is also one of the very shy Dutch community members, but he does a lot of work. Don't, don't, right? Right, right, Ronald? You do a lot of work, right? Yeah, yeah a little so, bit, a little bit. So. He is overly shy, so that's why I'm getting here. Um, and you <coughs> can now announce. And the winner is. The winner is. Mello by Mello Uthing. from UT. <laughs> Where is your team? They're flying back to Hungary. Okay. Okay, so this one is going to go in the mail for, the, for them. Okay, great. Uh, Ronald, thank you for announcing this award. And you can please take your seat again. Ronald, ladies and gentlemen. Ryan, Ryan, where are you? You need to build some sort of balancing mechanism in these guys. They're so nervous. They're drunk, they don't sit. It's amazing. See, he's going to fall again. You, you give him too much beer. 
Yeah, free, free beer, right? Free beer? Free beer. Free beer. Who said free, free beer? beer? <laughs> uh, the next category is a Joomla component. And the nominees for the best Joomla component in the Joscars Awards 2010 are... Duckman. Flexi Content. K2. And Sobi2. And announcing the winner is somebody from the Belgian community. Who? Steven, where are you? Is he here? No? Paul? Ah, there he is. Mr. Delbar, come on here. Our proud Belgian. <coughs> Paul Delbar, ladies and gentlemen, a proud Belgian. There are not many, but he is what? one. Not many Belgians or not many proud Belgians? Uh, is that like saying how many famous Belgians are there? None. None? No. Okay. I thought, well, it, was, I thought it was Tintin. He's one. But. Yeah. You can go. Thank you. Yes. The winner is K2. Again? Yes, hi. <laughs> it's me. Uh, we were going to say a few words. I, left uh, Harris. The big guy. I'd like left to say Yes, go ahead. I just uh, want to say thanks for appreciating our work and nothing more. Some, in, some, some inspiring final words for this. Yeah. Uh, well, let's hope that we'll make your life easier with uh, Joomla 1.5 and 1.6 and eventually someday version 2. And we promise to be there all along uh, for the coming years to support the component. Okay? Thank you. Thanks, man. Paul? Thank you. And the next category is for the best Joomla module or plugin. Bit of a loose definition of the words modules and plugins. Really? But. And the nominees are. I'll do just for fun. All videos. Better preview. JCE. And I don't know what this one is. No, I've not heard of it. Uh, Nuku Framework. Is that a plugin? <laughs> it's a library. So, when is it? <laughs> so um, which countries did, haven't we had yet? Switzerland. Who is here from Switzerland? There we are. Come on over. Our Swiss friends. And your name is? Lawrence. Lawrence. Hi, Lawrence. Lawrence. And Hi. you're coming from where in Switzerland? From Bern. From Bern. Great. You get the uh, honor of announcing this and announcing this award. Okay. And the winner is? Model or plugin? JC. Wow. <laughs> where is Ryan? Where's Ryan? What? Ryan Demmer, is fortunately, is in London at the moment, so to collect the award on his behalf, I'd like to invite Alex Prima to collect it on his behalf, because they live quite close. And maybe this time he'll actually get to come out to give a drink. Thank you. You take that for him as well. Thank you very much. Thank you, guys. OK, the uh, next category. Uh, which is the final one of the Joomla extensions, is for the best Joomla admin extension. And the nominees are... The Advanced, advanced Module Manager. Akiba Backup. Flexi Access. And JUpdate Man. Sounds like two now. And for this one, any French in the room? Any French? It, the Italian will go next. Not French. I need to be careful with those. Emmanuel, where are you? Well, he is, he's up, he's potentially going to... Oh, yeah, I cannot do that, right? Uh, let's find another country. I an, American, an American. An American. Joe LeBlanc. Ah, yeah, true. Where are the Americans? Ah, ha, ha, we found one. You were hiding. Sneaky you. For admin-only extensions, and the winner is... Akiba Backup. Woohoo! Come on over, Nicholas. Thank you. Uh, can you say a few words? Yes, this time I will try to say a few words. <laughs> Thank you very much. Uh, 
the success of this component is actually, actually lies in the community. You support me, I try to do my best, uh, you award me. Thank you very much. <laughs> Thank you, Nicholas. Thank you, Thank you Joe. Does so anybody else notice a little bit of a Greek thing, thing tonight? <laughs> so it, it's quite funny. We We're, the <laughs> here we are in Germany. Greece is relying on Germany. Now Germany is relying on Greece. <laughs> now we get on to the individual awards. Uh, who is, by the way, getting a free uh, rehab? Uh, uh, to a rehab forum clinic, uh, forum junkies, they are nice people, but sometimes they need to go on vacation too, so we have planned a nice uh, rehab vacation for them. I've worked this one out perfectly. <laughs> go ahead. This one's great. This one's great. And the nominees for the forum junkie in the Joscar Awards 2010 are Amy Stephen, Jean Marie Simone, Maraka Stavenberg. I see that was easy for you, that would have been impossible for me. <laughs> And Peter Martin. Which country we haven't had yet? Let's see. We had the States, we had Brazil. Which far and away countries are here? Oh, our Vietnam friends. Where are they? Oh, there they are. Come over here. So, the queen is Amy Steven. Well, oh, yeah, right, right, right. I'll, I'll, thanks very much. Unfortunately, unfortunately, Amy Steven couldn't be couldn't here make tonight. It. Um, we have a pre recorded video of her, but I'll show that to anybody who wants to see it later. <laughs> we sent the Joomla jet, but unfortunately, there were some problems with the volcano and she couldn't make it here. Whoops. So, the next category is the Code Junkie, and the nominees are Andrew Eddy, Joe LeBlanc, Dad, uh, <laughs> Johan Janssen, <laughs> and Peter von Weston. I need to figure out which country we haven't had yet. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Uh, Italy. Italy, right. Italians. Where are the Italians? Oh, a beautiful lady from Italy. Come on over here. Where's the mic? Oh, sorry. Yeah. <laughs> Don't lose the mic. And the winner is Johan Johansson. That's me. Right? <laughs> Thank you. Can I? Shall we kiss? Thank you, Chiara. I will say my few words later. Do I need to say a few words? Yeah. Thank you all. Um, you said a few. That was three. <laughs> there you go. Go on, you can have a few more. A few more? A few more. Okay. We won't no. charge any extra. <laughs> I actually was thinking I was getting free. Where's the free beer? Do I get a free beer for that, Mr. Ryan? Yes. Excellent. Free beer for all? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Well, I believe free beer for all after the, the Oscars. I say so. Let's make it happen. Thank you all, and uh, it's a great honor to receiving this award. Uh, actually, it's more an award that I can receive for all the code that we have worked on together. Uh, I wrote a lot, and other people have wrote a lot, and together we have made Jumwa. Together we're now working on Nuku with our community guys. This is also great to be able to present the code that has been written, as in worked on together. That's what I want to say, and now we can move on to... So moving on, the next award is for the Blog Junkie, and the nominees are Amy Steven, <laughs> Brian Tiemann, and Christopher Sandman. And I'm looking for another country, which one we haven't had yet, Norwegians. Are there Norwegians in the room? Where are the Norwegians? Apart from Christopher. Uh, there. Torkil. Ah, Torkil. <laughs> Torkil, get over here. 
I'll, I'll. Yeah, I've, <clears throat> yeah, I've had more than one beer. <laughs> and the winner is Brian Tiemann. Congratulations. Thanks very much. <clears throat> so, Brian, you can say a few words. I really don't care. <laughs> Agree or disagree, I don't care. There you go. Congratulations, uh, thank Brian. you very much. Um, writing those blogs is difficult. Actually, it's the blog posts that I don't write that are even harder. Sometimes it's easy to sit there and go, Vroom! but those are the ones that nobody wants to read. The ones that you want to read, and the ones that get the most comments and the most people reading them, are usually 300 words that take 30 minutes a word to write. So thank you very much, and I really appreciate it. Uh-oh. This is a hard one, though. No? Yeah. Yeah, it is. Yeah. And this is the final award of the ones that were nominated uh, by the Joomla community. And after that, we have the two special awards. Special awards. So. The document the I'll put these teeth in again. The document junkie is Chris Rob, Davenport, Claire Mandeville, Maraca Stavenberg, and Mark Dexter. And <laughs> which country I haven't had yet? Spain. Spain? Spain? Spanish people? Yeah. Aha. Come on over. You were also hiding. Don't do that. <laughs> you shouldn't hide. I, I cannot find you that way. Spanish, why? why? I, 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 I didn't hide. You, you were all the way back on a, yeah, I didn't see you over there. Yeah, you don't do that. You found it. Yeah, I found him. He, he need glasses. You put That's true, yeah. I need glasses. I could use this. Mike. I need a lot. I need a new foot, for example. Foot 2.0. Okay. <laughs> there we go. When will it be ready? <laughs> I'm actually going for the 3.0 version, so I can do it in 2015. Will it be committed to SPN? I don't know yet. I'm looking at Git. More, more, it's more social, you know? It's more social. Yeah, and okay. you also Sorry. Have, the, you have the, the social kicking in the butt kind of thing. Comes with it. It's a nice come, feature. Come, uh, <laughs> <laughs> Should we hide this? No. So, the winner is Chris Davenport. Where is he? Come on, Chris. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank you very much. I can't help noticing that uh, documentation has come after coding again. <laughs> because it's more important. Yes. You can't do the documentation until the code has been written. OK, OK. <laughs> I, I can see I've still got a lot of work to yeah. do. Yeah. Um, anyway, I'd just like to say thank you very much, and uh, in, in particular to the, the, the 6,000 or more um, people who have registered on the wiki uh, and have contributed uh, to the documentation uh, that apparently has made me look rather good. <laughs> Thanks. 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 Oh, Chris. Are we going to it? Yeah. Whatever. Okay. And now on to the special awards. Uh -oh. uh, these special awards were selected by another jury. I'd like to invite them all up onto uh, the front here to present this award. And uh, the first person from Belgium was Paul Delbar. The second person from Canada is Victor Dover. Jack Bremer from England. Jeremy Wilkin from USA. Rene Kreivald from the Netherlands. Matthew Pilgon, if I express it. Philgene from South Africa. And Thomas Karl from Germany. There we go. Applause for your jury. <laughs> I wanna, I'm going to do an interview. 
I'm going to do a small review. Like, can I ask a quick question about the voting process? Yeah. I wanna, I'm, I'm kind of curious how that went. So, How did you do the voting? Uh, we didn't actually vote. We discussed and discussed and discussed. And at some point, we said we've discussed enough. You are the guys that were still running up until 4 a.m. last night. None of these guys were there at 4 a.m. Uh, maybe. You were. He, one, yeah. Three. He, he called it a so, so, Renee, Renee what, what was the hardest decision to make? Um, the hardest decision to make is uh, who not to choose. Yeah, I can see that. Jeremy, um, did these master Joomlers let you participate in the discussion? No. no. I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'm just checking. I've got innovation. We will solve that next time. And, and, then, and then finally, um, being from all of the way, the other, other continent, South Africa, um, working with all these European-American people in the voting process, did, did that work for you? I guess it gives a new insight into um, a couple of interesting points that have been raised in the past about Joomla and management. Could you like mention one point? Uh, <laughs> no. <laughs> Can we do it after the J Oscars then? Um, if we get free beer. I'll tweet it. <laughs> Ryan, where are those beers? <laughs> well, if you come over here as the president of OSM, you need to bring a present, my friend. <laughs> this, is not about, this is not about freedom or free software. It is about free beer. This is how we do things here, right? And the penguin fell again. OK, guys. Brian? It's, it's you. Uh-oh. All right. Um, uh, we were tasked with a very uh, a vague uh, type task. Uh, and, and so we kind of first had to define uh, what we were giving the award for. And this is the uh, Joomla Innovation Award. Uh, and, and we really wanted to give uh, this to someone who continues to push the limits, and it kind of makes the community go, uh, wow. Um, basically, um, a, a lot of excitement, as many of you know and heard you know, the past two days and tomorrow, uh, the CCK field in Joomla has exploded uh, in the last 18 months. And so um, after narrowing down many uh, different um, areas, we, we focused on, on some of those developers. And uh, in the last year, one person uh, has uh, stood out. Um, and this award, I should say, is uh, mostly for um, to late 2009 and the last uh, six months. Uh, and so we chose um, uh, Emmanuel Denon. Are you here, please? Thanks. For Flexi Content. <laughs> Woohoo! Innovation or This is innovation. Yeah. Come on up. Congratulations. Emmanuel. And, and there are many excellent projects uh, that we all saw today. Uh, and I think uh, Emmanuel's talk this morning really had everyone say, wow. And uh, we really uh, loved how he continues to push the limits um, farther and farther and, and continually set the bar higher. And, and I believe uh, he's very, well, recently new to even programming, which is even more impressive again. And uh, once again, congratulations. Yeah. Thank you. Um, so first, thank you for this uh, award. Uh, it was a, a little surprise for me. <laughs> uh, I don't know what to say, but uh, just uh, Joomla rocks. And <laughs> that's all. <laughs> what was it Ryan this, was saying this morning? If I say Joomla, you say? Rocks! Say rocks. If I say Jane, you say <laughs> somebody was awake this morning. Thank you. And the final award of the evening for the personal contribution to Joomla. Again, we kind of uh, we struggled a little uh, about to decide what this meant, uh, and so uh, excuse us um, if we interpret it uh, in a unique way. Uh, but really, we wanted to give this to someone who managed. Uh, to find very creative ways uh, to find problems that, um, that are kind of small, but when you do them enough, you know, they really drive you crazy. Uh, and this person has uh, done this in, uh, kind of in the same way in numerous areas, and I'm going to list those a little bit. Um, but we also thought that this should be a, a kind of a pat on the back for supporting that community. Uh, and, and I think, you know, when you look at the title of that award, I think it makes sense. So this uh, person, um, I'll, I'll start with something that you may not know of, has applied these similar skills to the Joomla extensions directory, which you know is kind of a 
a big dinosaur that we're kind of trying to change a little and make it a little better for all of you users and developers. Uh, you know, but it's a slow going, and, and this user has really made some good contributions and made that process a lot better for us guys who are kind of behind the curtain. Um, in addition, things that you will have known for sure are really great solutions in the form of plugins or uh, modules, uh, cache cleaner, admin bar, uh, Docker, advanced module manager, modules anywhere, articles anywhere, re-replacer, and sorcerer. And so uh, our winner for personal contribution is Peter Van Westman. So unfortunately, Peter's not here. Um, I spoke to him just before the event. So Peter, are you coming to um, J and Beyond? You're nominated for a few awards. And I think he was uh, shortlisted in, comp in module plugin and an administrator extension as well. And he said, I'm going on holiday to Italy. I said, what sort of an excuse is it I'm going on holiday? If you were going on holiday to Greece, I could, I could see that, but <laughs> Italy, come on. Where's your commitment to Joomla? Going no. on holiday. But, no, seriously, Peter deserves this award, and um, he's in Belgium, yeah? No. In, unfortunately, in the unfortunately, it's not. We would love well, to Well, there have you were. You would have had a famous Belgian. <laughs> We'd love to have him, but he's not. You would have had a famous um, person from the Netherlands. So if anyone uh, lives nearby to, in the same area as uh, uh, Peter, if they'd um, come up afterwards and uh, take the award to give it to him personally, we'd really appreciate it. Okay. Another round of applause for Peter. And another round of applause for our jury. Thank you very much for, for jury, making that please. very hard decision. Before we end, we we have this little surprise. Yeah, you, yeah. So I've been really good whilst I've been here. I've not been on the internet. I've not tweeted. So you've not got bored. And as Garant, I've not been telling you what I had for my lunch, for my dinner, for my breakfast, what time I went to the bathroom. So it, it was, was safe for you to be online. It was quiet on Twitter, I must say. But I did switch on the laptop just before, and I switched on Skype, and I got one of those little alerts. And they said, there's a birthday. And we have a birthday in the room, and I'd like to bring the birthday boy up to the front of the room, Mr. Arnold Wender. Come on, Arnold. Come on up. Are you going to sing? No. I will not sing. Of course, there is no birthday without a song. And um, Robert will set it in. We've got no free beer, but we do have free cake later. So we will go. Happy, happy, happy birthday, birthday, to birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Arnold. Happy birthday to you. How many hips do we Whoa, whoa, whoa. Birthdays go with heavy berets, and we have 29 of them to go. Here's the first one. Hip, hip. Hip hip! 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 Dan! Hip hip! 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 Another nine! Hip hip! 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 One more! Hip hip! Woo! 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 So we'll leave it here for the moment and then you can just do it. Yeah. <laughs> and this is also where, where the, the girl that presents the cake gives the kisses to the birthday boy? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Congratulations, happy birthday. We, we, we do, uh, eat it later. Yeah, yeah. Okay, thank you. Thank you. Okay, yeah. That's it, so I'm just going to do that bass slide. Right? Oh, we're we're picking a piece of iron over here. Okay. Ryan! Ryan, come up here. Yeah, I'm 50 tomorrow. You're 50 tomorrow? That's mm -hmm. no problem. Can we do that in two stints, please? Every chair. Every chair. 
Okay. Ryan, come over here. And can I make a suggestion? Lose the jacket? Yes. This is Europe. Much better, my friend. Much better. Ah! There we are. So, so Ryan. Yes. I love your speech this morning. Uh, you have been to many events, right? Or European events, American events, African events, and all over the world. What is your impression of us Europeans being the first time on a Yuma event here in Europe? Wow, that's, that's observant. This is the first time on uh, continental Europe for me to be at an event. It's been, uh, it's been incredible. I think that it's, what's most important for me is to see the diversity in the audience of people from everywhere. It's been fabulous. It's been great. Very nice. What did you learn about us Europeans? <laughs> well, uh, from the number of times I was called out to give free drinking, uh, <laughs> and, and, I, and I should say, when I learned that way, the reason why it got quiet upstairs here was because everybody ran to the bar downstairs. <laughs> I understand you guys like to have a good time. Yeah, exactly my point. It was a little hint there. So oh, God. since you are the president of OSM, right, you go, you go over the budget too, no? <laughs> No, always under budget. Always, but oh well, <laughs> but there is always budget for free beer, right? This things can be. <laughs> they, 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 I am always interested in new budget ideas. Well, it's, 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 it's a suggestion. You can take Fair it enough. for granted, but we kind of like free beer, no? Yeah. 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 And, and I think that everybody here would like one now, no? Yeah. So, so I've got the wallet. Let's go. <laughs> Uh, well, that's what's, but I, that yeah. was my practical joke. <laughs> <laughs> We've known each other too long. <laughs> so all that talk of beer. I, I, I see you have the trademark. That's very nice. <laughs> yeah, well, but that... <laughs> it took us six months to get approval, but we got it. It's called, it's called the J-Ale. <laughs> it will be officially brewed once we get approval to brew it. Ah, excellent. Well, this is, you know, And you go over use. approval processes too, no? That's just correct, yes. yes. So we can get approval to brew our own beer? Well, it depends. It's a different patent and law and standards, and there's like 180 countries. We will work it out. <laughs> okay, so, Brian. Thank you very much. Thank you, everybody, for talking part. Thank you, everybody, for voting. Congratulations to all the winners. The bar's open downstairs. Have a good evening. And the beer is free. That was a nice practical joke, no? That was good.